On Friday, a series of cryptic posts began to appear on r pan, a Reddit community that seemed to materialize out of nowhere. On public access television, anyone can be a star, read one post, a gif with text overlaid on a grainy background. Today we live in a society where many choose to have a televised voice. What was r pan? No one knew, but Redditors began speculating right away. WTH is this? Someone explain? One user commented. Reddit giving us a dick tickling tease here, offered another. One user, u slash infinite, got to work sleuthing and stumbled upon a subdomain with the phrase Reddit service streaming backend. Reddit, it seemed, was planning to launch some kind of streaming service. With a little more digging around the source code in the Reddit app, u slash infinite could even see what it would look like. Today, so can everyone else. Head to Reddit's front page and you'll find the all-new Reddit Public Access Network, where you can see warm-blooded Redditors giving a rare glimpse of the other side of the screen. This is Reddit's first taste of live video, and, as such, Repent is a limited-time experiment, set to run from 9 a.m. to 5 p.m. through the end of this week. Consider it another dick-tickling tease for when Reddit launches live streaming for real in the coming months. For most of its 14-year history, Reddit has been a text-only platform. What began as a link-sharing service quickly grew into a destination for our online discussion, where communities big and small formed to talk about everything from r slash world politics to r slash rare puppers. Even as Reddit introduced support for photos and video, leading to the formation of communities like r slash cursed images, text has remained central to Reddit's identity. But in 2019, it's hard to be a platform without live video. Twitter has Periscope, Google has YouTube Live, Amazon has Twitch. When he introduced Facebook Live in 2016, Mark Zuckerberg described it as having a TV camera in your pocket, an idea that seduced both users and advertisers. For Reddit, which has been on a path toward modernizing its platform since co-founder Steve Huffman rejoined the company four years ago, live streaming felt like an obvious next step. We know that our users are familiar with streaming across their internet experience, because they're seeing it on other platforms, says Alex La, Reddit's VP of product. It's become an expectation that a platform should offer this. Ariel Pardes covers personal technology, social media, and culture for Wired.